Hi Booktube, so the book I want to review today is All the Days Past, All the Days to Come by Mildred D. Taylor. It's the final book in the Logan Family Saga, which started with Roll of Thunder, Hear My Cry. And I loved these books. I read Roll of Thunder, Hear My Cry in 8th grade, which was a part of one of the class reads. Um, and I reread that this year for Well Read Black Girl Book Club that I run, who wrote to Memphis and Let the Circle Be Unbroken. I've read those numerous times. I was really excited to read the final book in this family saga. All the days past, all the days to come follows Cassie from World War II to today. So you see the Great Migration, you watch her as she goes through school. It's a nice last book to see what happens to the family that you've grown to love. Reading this was like saying goodbye to an old friend. I think it's well written. It's a large book, but yeah, you're going through a lot of history. And I think what makes it really unique and well done is how you see Cassie grow as a person. So you go from Roll Thunder, Hear My Cry when she's a young girl through a teenager with the other books. And now you see her as a young adult and then as an adult and you see her as she wants change and as the civil rights occurs. I think Mildred D. Taylor does a great job of showing the steps to the civil rights. I feel like for the civil rights, so much of it is just shown as the civil rights. You don't see the precursor and all the different things and events that happened that caused the civil rights to occur. And then you don't see the aftermath. This book does a good job of showing the lead up to the civil rights. And then the after you see so many other pieces of history american history but particularly african-american history and i loved it i will totally get a copy of it when it comes out the logan family saga is one that i always hand sell and tell people to buy because i think it's incredibly important i feel like to Kill a Mockingbird is seen as the great race novel, even though it doesn't talk much about the people who are impacted by racism. But Roll of Thunder, Hear My Cry, you see it through the eyes of a girl who's the same age as Scout pretty much. But you see how it directly impacts her versus a girl learning about it. You see somebody who lives it. So thank you for watching my video. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe.